that we're part of their family and they're part of ours. Today at sunset, Muslims around the world ended their fast with food and friends as they continue to celebrate the Islamic month of Ramadan. But tonight in Woodland, the Muslim community hosted some special guests as they were joined by city leaders and the larger interfaith community. And that's where we find CBS 13's Ansar Hassan live in Woodland with what it was all about, Ansar. Yeah, Shwin, it has been a difficult six months for the region's Muslim community. Four local mosques attacked or vandalized in the Sacramento area. And there was last week's anti-Sharia march. Well, in response tonight, the members here of the Woodland Mosque held a dinner. It was an attempt to build bridges and break down barriers. What better way to build community bonds than through food? The Woodland Muslim community cooked up a big meal to celebrate the end of their fast and a way to share some of their traditions with the community at large. This type of inclusion is just wonderful in a community that's, that really acts on its diversity. It doesn't just talk about diversity. It is diverse and it is welcoming and it is very inclusive in nature. The deeply loathed, most feared week for every student, finals week. This evening's event was titled From Fear to Friendship, an attempt to break down barriers and stereotypes between local Muslims and their neighbors. How teenagers that are Muslims feel in today's community, society, and to be able to speak on that and just clarify everything is a great opportunity. Among those in attendance, Woodland's mayor. He says he came out not just to participate, but also to help facilitate a better understanding of an often misunderstood group in his city. They have been a strong supporter in being able to um, create our community here in Woodland, whether it's in businesses, recreational activities, development here. Um, it, we're all a community, and it's being able to show that we're in solidarity with them. That show of support is key for young Muslim Americans like Arbaz Salim, who grew up in Woodland. He says it says a lot about his city. That we're part of their family and they're part of ours. Now, hundreds came out. It was well attended by city leaders and other members of the interfaith community. Shirin, the month of Ramadan ends next weekend. All right. Ansar Hassan live for us in Woodland tonight. Ansar, thank you.